Our Tar Heel Traveler has been enjoying Mayberry Days in Mount Airy. The festival celebrates the Andy Griffith Show and draws many of the actors who appeared on it back in the 60s. Tonight, Scott Mason connects with a character actor who's famous for another show, too. Well, here I am. Darn it. <laughs> there he is, more than 50 years ago. Ronnie Shell. Were you a good stand-up comedian? Yes. <laughs> he started his career doing stand-up and once opened for the Kingston Trio. I'm going home, Lord, I'm going home. In the audience was a manager from the Andy Griffith Show who invited Ronnie to audition. I tried out for it, and luckily I got the part, and that's how I got into television. And on to the Andy Griffith Show. Oh, I'm sorry. That's how we say, uh, let's get things rolling. <laughs> it helped my career, I'll tell you that much. Ronnie Shell is at Mayberry Days in Mount Airy, reminiscing. One episode where I was uh, a fur salesman. There you are, 1100. Do you enjoy coming back to Mount Airy? I very much. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. Shazam! Ronnie was a regular on Gomer Pyle. How many episodes of Gomer Pyle did you do? 99. 99? And what was your character? I was his best friend, Duke Slater. All right, you nitwit, you lame-brained, you knuckleheads. He had a knack for the stage, went on to make movies, and even had his own TV variety show with Goldie Hawn. So it was good. I've had a great career. I've had my turn. And it's still his turn among the Mayberry fans at Mount Airy. Nip it in the bud. Mayberry makes me smile. Here, the actors from yesterday are still in. Oh, no, 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 no! What a legend. The Mayberry Days Festival runs through Sunday in Mount Airy.